Hello, in this video I want to show you an algebra book that has really, really hard problems in it. It's got really challenging problems, and the cool thing is the problems are like accessible in the sense that you could in theory do them. Like if you knew basic math, you could probably do these. And they're just messy. It's just, they're just messy problems. The book also has uh, easy problems. I'm sorry, I have to smell it because my copy smells incredible. Oh, it smells so good. And I really want to get the other books in this series, and I don't own them yet. I just haven't been willing to spend the money, and maybe I should be. They're kind of expensive. This one is actually also not super inexpensive. But the book has really hard problems. Let me just show you right away like what I mean by hard. So like, okay, so here's an example. So here in, in this exercise set, it says desarrollar. Right, yes, it's another language, I know. We'll get to that. So you have you basically have to um, expand these, right? So not, not so bad, right, not so bad. But look, you get down to 27 and you've got three terms. Like, huh, huh, look at 24 there. Well, that was that's only squared, but look at look at 25, right? Or, or look at 26 or 27, right? So it's getting a little bit more complicated. And this is used to teach basic algebra, right? And it's the most popular book in the entire world in Spanish, like in, in, in Spanish-speaking countries, every person knows about this book. It's, it's the legendary Algebra Baldor. I don't know if that's Baldor, I don't know who that guy is. And they have some that have different covers. Uh, this is just the one I got, and I got this one because it was the cheapest one I could find. Um, and the books are still pretty expensive because they're popular and they're being used all over uh, the world, right? In Spanish-speaking countries. Yeah, wow. Look at all these exercises. Oh, and the best thing about this book is you have answers to every single problem. Yeah, yeah, every single problem. Here we have to simplify. Look at this. Simplificar. Okay, so those don't look so bad, right? Right, but then you get over here and look. You got to simplify. So you got, now you got three terms, right? Ah, ah, right? So this is, look at number 29. That's going to cause some effort for someone learning for the first time. So it has a good variety. It does start with the easy stuff. So uh, it's a good book. It's just, it really drills your algebra. I feel like anyone who uses this book for a course in college and does well, props. You're going to come out a monster, especially if you get a good grade. Because I can see how you know, you could easily make this a very great book to work with or a very difficult book to work with. You have to solve the following equations. The very first one has fractions in it right away. There's no, there's no rest. m over x minus 1 over m equals 2 over m, right? And then check this out. Wow. Wow. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Fun times, right? These are really cool. I feel like I should do some of these. I should make some of these videos and do some of these problems. I probably will. I love this book. I love this book. Let me smell it one more time. Ah, oh, I'm so glad I got it. It took me a while to buy it because it's not super um, inexpensive. The reason is it's in Spanish. That's right. The book is actually in Spanish. And no, there is not an English version available. I don't know if anyone's actually gone through and done uh, an English translation. Um, but yeah, legendary book uh, written by Baldor, who was a legendary uh, math teacher. So... He basically uh, left Cuba, Baldor was born in Cuba, and he left Cuba, and then he went to Mexico for a short while, and then I think he went to the, came to the U.S., and he just taught. And he wrote a bunch of books. He's got this one, and then he's got a geometry book, and I think he has an arithmetic one, too. I don't own the other books yet. I don't own them yet. i got to get them. This is the only one I have. And it's because they're, they're not, um, you know, they're not, they're not inexpensive. But I, I wanted to get one, and so I, I made the sacrifice, and I got this one. Because this is the algebra one. I thought, oh, look at, look at these. Look at these systems of equations. Four equations, four variables, right? No joke, right? Baldor. Baldor. Really good source of, um, of math problems, you know? And I, I got this for a couple reasons. So I speak Spanish. It's my first language. So I wanted a way to learn, like, all the Spanish uh, math words. So I just got to smell it here. So I wanted a book that would explain everything. And this does, like, it even has a CD. You see here, it talks about, see all those words in bold? Those are all mathematics words in Spanish. And so you can actually use this to like get better at learning math in Spanish. So I think that's important because I speak Spanish and I can read Spanish. Like I can, I can read this. Let's see. Descomponer a x más b x más a i más b i. Los dos primeros términos tienen el factor común x y los dos últimos el factor común i. Um, so I think, uh, yeah, so I can read it, but a lot of times the words, like I didn't have 
some of those words like here, like even like restar, it's just a basic word like that. It's not something you can speak Spanish to your friends and you'll never use the word subtract, <laughs> right? So yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool. Anyways, I've talked enough about this book. Awesome book. I will leave a link in the description for sure. Um, yeah, I feel like I should go out and buy the other ones too now, but fantastic book. Algebra Baldor, I highly recommend it. Uh, if you want to learn math, by the way, I do have courses. They're not in Spanish though, sorry. Uh, but I do have algebra courses. I have a college algebra course and some other math courses. They're on my website, mathsorcer.com. They're actually on the Udemy platform. But if you do decide to get them, uh, use the website because one, it helps me greatly. And two, I lowered the prices on all the courses. So when you click my links, you should get a low price. So yeah. But uh, yeah, subscribe if you want to. And oh, I do have another channel where I do fitness. It's called The Fitness Sorcerer. If you take away anything from this video, a big, big takeaway, key takeaway is this book has insane algebra problems. I mean, it just has really good problems uh, for practice. What is this? More equations. Wow, and you have answers to all of them, which is really, really cool in the back of the book. And it is the most popular book probably in all of, you know, Spanish-speaking countries all over the world, all of, you know, Latin America, right? So South America, Mexico, Spain, you know, everybody knows about this book, right? Puerto Rico. This book is used everywhere. It is just one of those books, right? Awesome. And it's got crazy problems. So props to anyone who has used this and done well. It's taught generations of math students. Until next time, keep doing mathematics.